Give me two Big Macs. Two time, two Big Macs. <laughs> and they want Prince. Boom. It's definitely Rocky versus Drago. So um, I think, like, for Melbourne, it's going to be awesome, you know, live streaming around Australia. Eight-week camp, seven, eight-week camp, sparred hard, sparred big guys, by Andre the Giant, and guys about 120, 130, bigger than Bradford, better fighters than Bradford. May not have fought places I've fought, but yeah, he has proven himself as a champion. He's got the tricks, he's got the movements, he's got the belts too. He's a champion for sure. But there's a difference between champions he's fought and the champion he's going to fight against me. How can he beat? He can't kick me in the head. I don't think he can kick that hard. He's too wide and too muscly and too heavy to be able to throw fast boxing combinations. He's only got one round. If he doesn't kill me in the first round, if he doesn't take my head off in the first round, what's he got? I see it being as a war. If he's keen to stand in the pocket with me, I don't think he will once he feels my power. He's have a heart attack in the second. His lungs are going to give up in the third. By the fourth all, God knows what's going to happen to him. Probably going to just pass out if I don't knock him out. May the best man win. You know, if he catches me, good luck to him. But I've done my homework and I've got my game plan and he ain't fucking catching me. So three days ago, I got the call. Um, it's been a bit of a, a tragedy up, up there in Melbourne. I really feel sorry for Prince, I feel for him and his family, but life must go on, the same as the fight. So I had to change an opponent, and a young guy called Vinny Nasha. Um, short, stocky, powerful puncher, but look, it is what it is. And I've got to move on, I've got to do what I do best. Stand tall, walk forward, put whoever's in front of me, put them away, move on, get the paycheck and move on to the next fight. Simple as that. My name's Vinny Nasher. Dick Steve flies, 14 wins, two losses. Fight out of Rogers Gym in Camberfield. Yeah, I've taken his fight on late notice. Um, got a phone call of Prince. Unforeseen uh, reasons, you know, he's got to pull out. So I've got the call. And 100% wanted to fight Bradford, so it's a privilege to take on Bradford. Thank you very much for Prince to give me the opportunity to fight Bradford. You know, Chris has been around for a while, all around the world, for America a couple of times, Europe, Japan, all around Australia, so it's a good opportunity to take this and get a world title opportunity would be great. So thank you for Chris taking the fight and Prince for giving me the opportunity.